match will begin in three, two, one, go! As Autonomous kicks off, we do see Robonauts 118 toss their cube up top, cross over the charge station to midfield, pick up a cone, and start ferrying it back to their community. Meanwhile, over on blue, Hammerheads, they're going to stick tight, balance out that charge station, and Robonauts, while docked and engaged, toss a cone toward their grid. That cone does land successfully and scored on a hybrid node to close out Autonomous. Match in favor so far of the Red Alliance, 50-46. to 46. Robonauts reach up with their cone. They're going to place it on one of those outer grids. That co-op grid currently does have three game pieces for the Red Alliance over on blue. We see Hammerheads and their alliance partner Strike Force both working on their grids. Strike Force opts for the outer grid. Hammerheads add the second game piece into that center co-op grid. One game piece missing from that center grid over on the blue side for both alliances to agree to that lowered threshold for the sustainability bonus. The Red Alliance very close now to their second link. We've got a lot of game pieces over in that grid. A few of them not quite scored though yet for the Red Alliance. Robonauts drop off a cone in that middle row on the co-op grid. Their alliance partner Mort reaching on up, trying to get five points with a cone on an outer grid. Turning our attention back on the blue side of the field, Strike Force in blue drops off a middle row cone. Their alliance partner Hammerheads is right in front of the blue alliance co-op grid with a solid robot signal light. Their partner Nerdspark working around them to finish a link for the blue alliance on the outer grid. The Blue Alliance has scored three links so far, and our board indicating that they do now have the three game pieces they need to lower the sustainability bonus ranking point down to five links instead of the typical championship six. 35 seconds remaining in the match. Blue Alliance with the lead, 128 to 101. That grid filling up for the Red Alliance. We'll see a link starting to get finished off here. We do now have another link for Red. That's coming from Ratchet Rockers out of Missouri. Ratchet Rockers up crossing that charge station. It looks like they're going to move back into their community. 15 seconds remaining. No robots engaged quite yet. We do have two on blue trying to level out that charge station. That'll be 20 points for the Blue Alliance, including their Auton. They're going to pick up that ranking point over on red. All three together on the charge station. 30 points for the Red Alliance. We're going to have 22 endgame for blue. And it looks like a rolling off robot also might mean 22 for the Red Alliance. We'll have to take a close look at that score momentarily. We've got a tight score coming out of that match. The winner, though, is the Blue Alliance, 163 to 155, four ranking points for the Blue Alliance in match 33. The Red Alliance did score enough links in their grid, so they will earn one ranking point coming out of that match. Qualification match 34 coming up shortly.